You know, Road America is an awesome event. It's a lot of families, a lot of people sitting up on the hills, enjoying the racing all day there. A really cool place as a fan to be able to walk around and see almost every corner. Wonderful racetrack, great area, cool town in Elkhart Lake. One of the best areas in the country to go see a race. Definitely worth the trip up there. The thing I like most about it is the concession stand and the bratwurst and the funnel fries, the sweet corn, I love it. Yeah, I don't know what was more exciting about Road America last year, the race at the front or the brat eating contest my crew had. It's got that old prestige to it. Not so much like the newer circus like we're seeing, but it's got that old grit to it. There's long straights, there's fast corners. To get the most out of the track and to get the most out of the car, you really have to put the lap together. The most intimidating corner in Road America is definitely the king, hands down. It's very fast. It's just a light break in our GTD car, and it's completely blind past the apex. As you come through the carousel, you've got an amazing test of skill. It's super fast, it's top gear. It's definitely hard in your throat every time through there. You can see the car being on the limit because the corners are so long, and I think that makes Road America very excited. The Continental Tire Road Race Showcase from historic Road America. Season winding down. No one is going to want to give an inch on the racetrack. Road America last year was an awesome race on a great track. Turner Motorsports controlling GTD. They win at Road America. Got to put us on a championship punt. We were in the game after that weekend. Quarters like challenge cars pitting. The young they charge is going hard at it. Squeezing by and staying in front, out of the pit lane. That's how we won the race. I'm looking forward to come back there and uh, fight for the win. We did a fantastic race. Was able to keep the BMW behind him. Watch Dirk Mueller, he's going to get a run off of turn three, he's going to try and attack for the lead. The last two laps, we end up uh, bumper to bumper. Yeah. Reese uh, Compensatione <laughs> wins at Road America. We got spun out, but we managed to recover pretty well, and we were losing performance on the track because we had a brake problem. During the pit stop, we managed to fix it. Then the car ran flawless until the end of the race. Joao Barbosa coming to the checkered flag through turn 14 one last time. They win at Road America and extend the championship points lead.